Services headed by Engineer Cornel Hodges. Our site development designer, EMS Architect. Thank you. And our site developer, Oro Geometric Builders Incorporated. Thank you. Of course, the construction management team of SP Castro Incorporated. We have representatives of our lending bank, BDO. I would like to call now uh, our students, of course, represented by their student leaders. We have the different central uh, CSG from the different levels and campuses here, right now. Student leaders, please. Thank you very much.
to contribute to the greater advantage of the whole group. The commemoration plaque at the entrance, which we will soon unveil, states, dedicated to all students who enter the halls of Savior Ateneo in search of Kura Personalis, care for the whole person, man, mind, body, and soul in the tradition of excellent Jesuit education. Blessed on 16th December 2017, in the 84th year of Savior University, Ateneo de Cagayan. Good friends, we emphasize that we built this sports center for our Savior Ateneo students. This sports center is for them, for their programs of sports and physical education. So they will realize that physical exercise is essential for healthy living. Others as a team, so they can become the best they are capable of becoming athletically. So they will learn to celebrate victory and accept defeat always graciously. My dear representatives, I know there are not so many, but my dear representatives of the Savior Ateneo students, please rise, please rise. They're at the back, they're not even seated. Let's give them a round of applause. My dear students, the basketball and badminton courts, the swimming pool, the track and field, the football pitch, these are all for you. Savior Ateneo Sports Center is for you. Use it, appreciate it, enjoy it. Experience excellence, Savior Ateneo. Let's give our students a round of applause for this beautiful gift. Our esteemed gratitude to our partners who work long and hard to build these magnificent sport facilities. Representatives of these organizations, please rise when I acknowledge your company so we can give you our applause of gratitude. The architect and designer of the Sports Center, Arch OJ Builders Incorporated, Architect Sasaleno and Architect Santos. Thank you very much. Our contractors, the contractor of the gym and the track and field oval, I, Constructors and Developers Incorporated, represented by Engineer F, Swimming Pool Construction Corporation, represented by Mr. Nicanor Foliosco. Orne, General Construction Services, responsible for the auxiliary facilities, including the fence surrounding. Engineer Achas is here. Thank you very much. The site development designer who planned out the road network and the spaces that will be used for this beautiful facility. Our architect, EMS Architectural Studio, represented by architect Ernest Soriano. XU alumnus. Our site developer who really implemented the site development plans, who made the road network, the street lights, the drainage, and animals on roads. Engineer Rolando Cortejos of Oro Geometric Builders. Thank you very much. Our construction manager, the representative of Xavier University in all aspects of the design, the construction, who watched over it from SP Castro Incorporated, led by Mr. Roger Antonio. The Thanking Salamat, SP Castro. Our lending bank, who believed in the project and agreed uh, to loan us the funds needed, and we hope we can pay you. <laughs> BDO Unibank, which is vetted by Ms. Ruena Vinche. Thank you also to the XU team involved in this project. I would like to mention specifically, he is not here, but our XU trustee and former assistant to the president for campus development who helped conceptualize this project. Let's give a round of applause to Father Eric Belandria. The former XU Vice President for Administration who headed the team who worked on the initial designs, he is here, Brother Noel Cantago. The current 
thanks you, Vice President for Administration, who supervised the construction from groundbreaking up to this moment of preparing the facility for the opening ceremonies, Mr. Edison Sasoy. Finally, not least, I would like most especially to acknowledge someone who showed extraordinary dedication and commitment to the day-to-day -day supervision and monitoring from planning to construction, dealing with all the issues and concerns and problems recently. Let us give a round of applause to the XU Campus Development Project Officer Engineer Noemi Nakunao. <laughs> Above all, today is a day to give thanks to the Lord for the blessing that is Savior Ateneo Sports Center. Our loving God is always the source of all good things. Our hearts are filled with gratitude to the Lord for this beautiful Christmas gift that He gives to the Savior Ateneo community. All praise and all thanksgiving to the Lord. When God gives us a gift, we can only respond by cherishing the gift, taking delight in it, taking care of the gift, sharing it with others, and using the gift according to the purposes of the giver, which can only be for Kura Personalis, promoting Mensana and Corpore Sano. Today, we give thanks especially to the Lord for His love endures forever. Let us give our loudest round of applause to our good and gracious God. We will now go to the part wherein we will unveil the marker for Robert Roberto C. Yap, the Society of Jesus. Accompanying with him is our most reverend bishop, Antonio Ledesma, Honorable Mayor Oscar Moreno, and Don Cardo Sedawang, Vice President for Basic Education. We would also like to invite Maria Teresa Aguilino, member of the Board of Trustees.